that. Uh, Who's this? The Nets coach. Yeah, yesterday said you're the best rebounder in the league. Are you trying to be the best shot blocker in the league? He said this for real? Well, he didn't yeah, say yeah. that. I'm asking if, you, if you're looking to be the best shot blocker in the league. He said, I'm talking about the rebounds. Well, he said that. You said that. He said that yesterday. I didn't know. I, I didn't, actually didn't know he said was the Nets coach. That's yeah, actually pretty good. Okay. Appreciate that, uh, Coach. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'll take whatever accolades you guys want to throw at me. Best, you know, best rebound in the league, best shot blocker in the league. I'll take it all. I'll take it all. I'm trying to go for it, too. How tough is it to come back within 24 hours, play that second game, getting the energy back? I mean, it's always tough, you know, going through back-to-backs, part of the league. But, uh, you know, I think us being at home helped out a little bit, you know, having that familiarity, coming here and uh, get a win tonight. You know, Trey was struggling a little bit, but I think for him coming out and, you know, settling the game down a little bit helped us get the win. How good is it to see your buddy beside you go off tonight? Yeah, man, he had a, a, a ridiculous stretch where he was just going off, making the right plays. Um, Making the right decisions, which is big for him, rookie guy, rookie guy trying to come back and make his way into the league. Uh, also appreciate that uh, lobby throw. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's doing great. 30, 30 and 20 last night, 20, 10 tonight. I know you've had a ton of hot stretches, but like, is it just getting easier? Are you figuring things out more? Um, honestly, I really think it's just just sort of my game. Like you know, I feel like you know the rebounds will come. Uh, my teammates find me, me doing what I need to do. But I honestly feel like just sort of my game, I feel like I can, you know, run, not run up and down the court, but, you know, if I go up down the court and do what I need to do, I feel like 2010 is a solid mark every night. John, a couple of uh, catch and shoot threes there in the first half. How did that help your confidence? I mean, you know, being able to shoot it, you know, I think, I, I think, I've, I think I've been proven, proven it enough, you know, my ability to be able to shoot it. Uh, some teams, some guys still disrespect me or play off me. I got to make a play. John Anthony Davis, one of the best bigs in the league, but you guys seem like you made a concerted effort to go at him Hell to yeah. help the game. Damn right, I mean, it's Anthony Davis. You know that dude's a, you know, one of the premier bigs in the league. So you go up against him, all your emphasis has got to be on him or trying to stop him. You know, he was hitting a lot of tough shots tonight, but you know, big, big, good players are gonna hit tough shots, so make them, make them all tough. There was a possession in the fourth quarter where you, uh, on defensive possession, we got two blocks back to back. How do you think the team was responding defensively in the fourth quarter to hold on to the lead? Yeah, we wanted to um, finish the game. I think we just went through a, a couple of stretches of games where you know we've seen the same thing come down late, late in the game, and we have a chance to win. And I think we wanted to win a little bit more tonight, uh, back to back. We wanted to you know at least get get one win while we're at home. How is it to get a victory on a uh, military appreciation night? Uh, it, it's fitting, man. You know what I mean. Come out here and um, it's sort of an ode, uh, or you know, paying my respects to my mom. My pops and everybody, you know, all the military uh, people that are serving us. So, uh, so shouts out to them, supportive of them. I'm a military kid, so I know all about it.